what's the best way to uh, use Cosmos? And the answer for that is that you use Cosmos for co-working hours. Uh, in order to do that, you first, you know, f um, talk to your team. Uh, oftentimes, teams which start using Cosmos are um, either struggling with the lack of interaction outside of scheduled meetings uh, or they feel a lack of um, um, a lack of uh, pace or a lack of uh, connection. So you talk to your team in a retro um, or uh, a conversation, set the time for uh, figure out what time can everybody be present uh, inside of Cosmos. Uh, that could be Mondays and Fridays for lunch time or 12 to 5 you guys do you uh, put it in the calendar uh, and once the calendar is set up you then show up and once you're in the space uh, everybody just picks up their own desks uh, and you use statuses to signal your availability um, some of you could be listening if you guys are really focusing that moment you can also be uh, focusing and that's totally fine and uh, that's the best way to use cosmos now for all individuals the last bit which i want to uh, focus on uh, is that for best experience i would request you to download the cosmos desktop app and i will also request you to not use cosmos like google meet or zoom for that matter uh, it, cosmos is not a video calling tool it looks like a video calling tool because it has video calling in it but it is not a video calling tool cosmos is a digital space and if you want to make the best of a digital space, you have to be in it. So uh, to experience the AHA, uh, please decide a time for you and your friends to be available in the space. Uh, and uh, then you can experience the AHA. Uh, if you people choose to not be in the space, then you're using it wrong. Um, and that's your choice. Um, but I'm just telling you how to make the best use of Cosmos.